Okay, we wanted to make this short video to show this new interlocking system for these doors. Here, let me come around here. Now, these doors are notorious for coming open in flight. And uh, Brian came up with an idea to keep them closed. It's very simple. doesn't involve any extra servos or complicated interlocks or anything. Um, well, all it is is, let me see if I can get around here. Where you, see. you got a, uh, a wire right here. This, this wire right here and it's attached to the wing and then you've got a latch on the door right here that that catches that wire as the door comes down and it holds the door shut it can't possibly open in flight so we're going to run it and uh, we'll, sh we'll see how that works come around here where you can... okay here we go Hopefully you can see that wire catch. I don't know if you can from here, but he's attempting to Well, that we, little box ain't working right. We use a servo driver instead of the radio in cases like this, and it's not working. Brand new. No, that's not working, huh? Start on. Huh? Well, just run this one here. <laughs> okay, oh, we got power. Oh, boy. All right, here we go. <laughs> See the door come down. I don't know if you can see that, but that little latch is catching over that wire that's connected to the door, to the wing. And now, if you try and lift that up, it's it's locked down. There's no way it's coming up in flight. So, and then back up again. It just slides off of that latch. And runs free like it always does. With a spring. With a spring, yeah. The spring's got to help it close. Yeah. yeah, there's a there's a spring in here. This key to where this spring right here is located. You can see where he has it in relation to the hinge pin. That's where you need the spring to be. And then then it's uh, past center, so it can pull it shut. Okay, and that's it. Now we can close it and have him get a better look at the, the door. <laughs>